everyone, Broadbent here, and welcome to Subnautica Below Zero full release 1.0. It's officially left early access. So today, we're going to give it a go. Um, I tried to avoid spoilers all this time. I've sort of seen glimpses of the intro, um, but this should be a complete fresh experience for me right now. I have played the game for about five hours, six hours in early access. So this intro this here is, is completely new. Take you on company space box, Robin. You sure you want this? The research is in everything. Oh. It is to me and Sam. I need to know what happened. The meteor storm. I can use it for cover from Altera's eyes. Okay. So we're in orbit right now. You, Robin. I'll find my way back. I can't even remember the original intro to be fair. <laughs> oh, we're towing the life pod. Whoa. Oh, come on, you gotta, you gotta cut away like that? Approaching 45, 46 speed. Surface temperature is... Oh! Drop uh, rip. Deployed. Well, that's home. Wow. Damn, that is a cool intro. 10 out of 10 for effort. What was the first one again? <laughs> I can't even remember. I think you just out exploring or something. Okay. Um. So that's the pot over there. Right. I need to get into the water. I think. Down here looks like the right thing. Yep. All right. I said down here. Right, so holy smokes. That did not go as planned. You think? I should find a way into the water and get to the drop pod. So, ever since they changed voice actors with the main character, I sort of like mentally distanced myself from the game. Like I I preferred the original voice actor. Um, I don't know, it just it felt a bit more comforting. Does that make sense? <laughs> anyway, uh, let's get to this life pod here and we should be able to begin. Can I just I can probably just start gathering stuff now, to be honest. Yes, I can. Beautiful. Okay. Gonna need you. Come here. Thank you. So, for the most part, this looks like an identical environment. I mean, doesn't it? At the very beginning intro with the avalanche, it's kind of the same thing. Um, I don't feel like much has changed. Interesting. I'm just really hoping that they've ironed out a lot of the bugs and, you know, lag spikes that sort of came with the early access, uh, sort of tag. Uh, so hopefully this is a lot better now. Cool. So here is our little pod here. So. The drop pod. No one's going to talk back. Okay. <laughs> cool. Uh, let's deposit some of this stuff. In fact, we can probably start making some stuff straight away here. Blueprints. Yeah. How do I get out of this menu here? How do I, how do I, how do I... I don't know how to play this game. Well, Sam. Ah, there, there we go. Got it. Okay. Some tools and resources before starting my search. Do they go with a that radio towers as easy to spot as Lil said? That sounds like their third voice actor. I think they changed voice actor again. What? <laughs> right. So we need a knife. Uh, where is that? Tools, silicon rubber, creepy vine cluster seeds. All right, cool. Let's just go straight to that. That shouldn't be... I keep doing that. That shouldn't be too hard. I think that is just down here. Remember it being much easier... Ah, there it is. It's easier to find this stuff at night, if I remember correctly. This is good food as well, right? Yeah. Oh, my God. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, come on, man. I'm not dying in the first, like, two minutes. Oh, we got a blizzard. Let's go down where it's nice. Where's the shale rock? Oh, no. Lead. Damn, that's good. Oh! Sea Glide Fragment right there. Was that even in this game before? I don't know. It's the, um... The ships that aren't in this game. Right, let's make some... No! Come on! I don't want to make lubricant. Silicon rubber. Thank you. Okay, let's get a knife on the go. I've got some fins. Let's work on the oxygen tank. What do I need for that now? Fiber mesh. Right, okay, so I need the ribbon plants, which are found in the caves, I think. Okay, I think... I think I know what to do now. <laughs> Let's get some of the samples here. 
Uh, we'll go for... Uh, how big are they? Alright, we'll call it that. <laughs> Fiber mesh. Alright. So I think that's what I need for the... O2 tank. And two titanium. Okay, I can do that. And a battery. Standard O2 tank. Let's go. Lovely. Alright, so we can die for a little bit longer. Like... Ooh, a repair tool. Oh, look at that. This creepy vine samples. It's got the, the health bar on the right of it. Like, how fast it's decaying. I might just eat it, actually. Right, let's go get some ribbons. Um, I think they're laying around in the caves. So, if I can go back a little bit and try and find some, that'd be great. There's another sea glide frag. Oh, yes. Lovely. So, I can probably make it quite quickly here. There's two. One there, one there, and then one back at the, the hub. Dude, so easy. Oh, my God. There's three. One, two, and <laughs> three. Dude, that's so much harder to find in the original game. What even? What is that, salt? Nope. <laughs> Where's my knife? I'd left my knife back of the thing. God damn. Ah. Aha. Can I please get some... Some ribbons? Hello? I'm scared. Bro, this is terrifying <laughs> at night. Oh! I mean, at least resources are easy to find. Oh! Oh! I thought you were friendly, boy. Alright, we're going to this supply cache. This hopefully will give me a little bit of, uh, I don't know, maybe some technology that I don't have yet unlocked. I'll take that beacon as well, that's good. First aid kit. Ooh, PDA. Nice. Samantha, Samantha AU and Fred. It's gone away. <laughs> I guess I just read slow. <laughs> Whoa! Do I want to be holding that? Wait, is that just like a, a light source? Oh, wow. That's kind of cool. Oh, oh, yeah. What's it called now? That place you gotta go to. That sounds like a distress call. Transmission of unknown origin. Source of transmission depth calculated at approximately 200 Push meters. bridges. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't worry. I remember some things. Right, I need to get some of these things for the batteries, the ribbons. Where are they? Not down here. Hey, there we go. I found one. I know they're just tucked away in like tiny little like alcoves or whatever you want to call these things. Lovely. Right, I need quite a few more of those. Yes, I know. There are way too many sea lead frags around here. <laughs> it's actually nuts. Right, let's get this scanner on the go. And get my knife. Scanner. Lovely. A man's best friend. Well, second best friend. They're nice, obviously. The best friend. Cool. Don't need the pipe. I've never used that. Never. In this uh, in this game or the original. Knife. Please come here. Thank you. Got this creature egg. I don't know what I can do with that. I think you might be able to make those um, grow in a tank. Don't hold me to it, but that, that would make sense. Alright, I'm taking all this out as like a basic supply here. Um, I don't think I want to mess with the flare. So that should be good. Right, so now I've got a scanner. Let's go crazy and try and get that sea glide on the gum. And there's the third piece. Right, let's go see what we need to make it. I'm pretty sure we need a battery. Where is it? Is it in deployable? Okay. Lubricant, battery, and copper wire. Easy enough. Right, let's go. Sea glide. And you're gonna need some like backup batteries. I want to go a good distance anyway. Right, let's go check out the um, the twisty bridges section, and uh, go dive in there. Now I can go a bit faster. I can evade some of the the faster creatures. And yes, right now there are a lot of things that I'm not scanning. Um, that's because I'll just get round to it. No, 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 no. Ah! Don't hurt me! Ah! Stop! Okay, let's try and make this deep dive all the way to the sanctuary. That's what it's called. Let's go. Uh, right. So, where's the... Okay, so it should hopefully be like this way to the right. Do I even want to be doing this down here? Probably not. Maybe I need like some better oxygen. I, I don't know. That's a sea glide. Uh, not sea glide. Sea truck fragment over there, I think. I think it's down here. Yeah, there it is. Let's go. Right, let's just uh, tunnel vision this here. Get some oxygen on the way. If this boy would get off my ass, go away! Oh, they're flashing now. That's new, right? As a part of the distress call, I guess. Cool, cool. 
Okay. Well, get me in here. I can say hello to Alan. Hello? Is someone there? Inner man speaking. We're running out of time. Are we now? What is all this? I can help you better if you show yourself. If we could show ourselves, we would not need storage. Hmm. You mean you don't have a physical presence? Are you one of them? An architect? Storage medium identified. We will be lost unless we find another ghost. Can you help? <laughs> can you use my PDA for storage? You are not with the group from before. Your cybernetic components bear their signal. Mm -hmm. Altera? <laughs> no, my equipment is uh, borrowed. Oh. <laughs> Oh, I can take the cube. I mean, I'll just take it. Seems a bit early on, but sure. Was that a thing before? Maybe I just don't have anything to like use it on. My equipment's borrowed. All right, so that's. I guess we got some new dialogue. How long have you been stored here? Changing the story, obviously. Yeah, I know. We may speak more once the transfer is complete. <laughs> more? You'll be in my yes. head, boy. Okay, hurry. Ah! Let's go! This was a really, so really cool sequence. Experience. Hope they haven't changed anything about this. Brace. There we go. Uh, what Cryer. <laughs> Damn. Complete. To say the least. How do you feel? Why do you sound like you're inside my head? The facility identified hospitable capacity within your cerebral cortex. You are in my head? I offered you my PDA. Get out! Oh no. Does your kind perceive a boundary between cybernetic and organic components? My mind is not a component. You sound <laughs> angry. <laughs> We will allow you a moment to process. Don't you go silent on me. Uh. Oh. Whoa. This is not happening. That's, that's new. It's not happening. Damn, that's cool. I like that it just collapses. And you can I get up here? Architect containment cube. Okay. Well, that's interesting. I like that this place just becomes a shell. Like you can tell it's it's dead, it's gone. Before the cube, I think was still there, just sort of green out. Right, now we're sort of okay. Let's uh let's check out this. Wait, I didn't read it. I never read it. A rebreather, cool. I do in fact need that. Uh right, so the sea truck, I think, was around here. Sea truck frag. Okay, let's just get up to the uh to the top. Now, I remember when the game first, well, Early Access Why? first came out, you could scan, um, like, alien structures and get reward points uh, with the company, Altera. I guess that's not a thing now, that makes sense. I should probably make the rebreather before coming back here. Probably got increased depth. Yeah, let's do that. Ooh, T to answer or E to dismiss? We understand this arrangement is undesirable to you. You're not real. Go away. To what? go, we require a suitable body for transfer. Why do you keep saying we? How many of you are there? One of us and all of us. We do not think of ourselves as individual, distinct. Why don't you start by telling me who you are? You may append your seed code to my species designation. Please call me Al Ann. My whole life I've been dying to meet a sapient space-fearing alien up close and you're telling me your name is Alan? Is it insufficient? No, it's fine. It's perfect. Where are you from, Alan? Your kind calls us architects. The precursor race. But what are you doing here? That is a long story. Perhaps you will prefer to focus on the construction of a new storage medium to which I may transfer. Yes. Fine, absolutely. How do we get you out of my head? I have added the information to your data bank. 
you will need the necessary components. Any idea where I can find them? It is unclear. I have been disconnected from my network for so long, I cannot locate the coordinates. <sighs> so I remember actually making a body, and I think that was as far as you could get in the story at the time. Right, I need to get some some silver, which I think we find I think we find down in the, the twisty vines. I believe what I'm after is the dark one. It's like a dark node. Oh no, it's this! Titanium! Wait, I'm gonna die here. Yo, 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 go, 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 go. I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Alright, so deeper clearly isn't an option. I think I want to go to that island. Is that, am I supposed to do that right now? That seems like the right thing to do. So, let's sort of mindlessly head in this direction. <laughs> Lithium. I will definitely take that. Silver, let's go. Alright, I need some more silver. And then I'm going to head back and get the rebreather. Although the, the beacon's here. There should be loads of pieces for the sea truck around here as well. I don't know why I'm still doing this. Alright, let's go down here. <laughs> Mineral rich crevices detected oh. Below. Oh, yo. Uh. Alright, where's that beacon? Yo, yo, yo. I know if I don't mark this, I'll struggle to find this later on. And here we are. I think when I came here last, this was area was incomplete. Possibly. Let's scan some stuff. Oh, is that PDA? Cargo rocket sea truck dock zero sector. Oh, I actually don't think... Dude, that's changed so much. Oh, okay. At least I think it has. All right. I want to get the uh, the sea truck first, I think. So I'm going to go back into the water a little bit and have a little look around. Ah! Oh! That scared me way more than it should have, but I thought it was like next to me. Come on, give me some gold. Damn it. I can now make the sea truck. Right, I think I have enough silver. How much do I have? Oxygen. All right, let's get a little bit more silver. New blueprint synthesized power cell. New technology acquired. Sea truck depth upgrade mark one. Lovely. There's weirdly just a few ribbons just laying around on top here. Definitely not going to pass those up. Right, finally got the rebreather. Awesome. So I can probably go deeper now, right? More efficient at significant depths. Cool. By recycling air more efficiently at significant depths. Breathe the freedom. Why did you say that like... She had such a sinister voice. Uh, yes, I'm going to make another battery. Definitely going to need that. Might even make a few more. Yeah, let's make two batteries. Right. Okay, this let's go. Whoa. recorded message. If you can hear this, you're trespassing. If you know it's good for you, you'll get the hell out of here. Ha! Good one. Well, at least we sort of... Well, I mean, I sort of know who that is. I still don't know if she's a friend or foe, though. I've forgotten that part. Heat me up. Thank you. Ah, you see, temperature is a massive thing now. At the bottom left, I didn't realize that. I remember it not being that big of an issue. Like how cold you were. You could sort of do whatever you wanted to with no limits. When it comes to temperature. <laughs> well, that's cool. What? The snowballs? Yo! Unidentified woman taking this island. Oh! Yep, Stop I remember this. Right there, Altera. You're out of bounds. I'm not with Altera. Then your position is doubly precarious. What do you mean? If you're telling the truth, you're out of your mind. If you're lying, there'll be hell to pay. Uh, Wait! Who are you? I guess I'm Take crazy. Off my land. Hell nah! This is a free world, right? Delta the woman station. in the exosuit has been traced as far as my technology will allow. Mm. In the future, I hope you will avoid contact with the woman in the exosuit. Ooh. I am among the last of a dying <laughs> civilization. If you were to compromise your well-being, the species could go extinct. What she... makes you think she's hostile anyway? A little grumpy, maybe, but... Who wouldn't be stranded out here alone? She did not respond to my distress call. And she is well armed. Maybe she's afraid of us. I have no desire to find out. Man's word and it makes sense. 
God. This game's so frustrating at times, man. Let me on top of the roof. I'll go inside the normal way. Don't worry. Fine. Oh, they've changed this place a lot. This wasn't overrun before. A locker. Thank you. I need that. Jukebox speaker. Altera PDA. Alien intruder. More like alien cheater. Yo, got aim hacks? Did I get the builder? Is that something that I've unlocked yet? Oh. I think I only scanned one piece and I've got to find the other fragments. I don't know what I'm scanning right now. <laughs> oh, the bed? Interesting. I'll take a poster. Thanks. Shaving kit? <laughs> Fred shaving kit. That's kind of cool. Dude, there's so much to scan in here. Oh my god. Fred's bed. Okay, I don't know why I need to scan individual beds. I want to check if I've got the, uh, the builder. Is it done in Habitat Builder? Yeah, okay, cool. Yeah, I can do that. Right, well, I think I've gotten everything from here, so I need to... Oh, never mind. Would you look at that? That will come in handy. I should be able to find my way to Phi Robotics where Sam worked. Wow. There's one over at the lily, lily pads. This is where we are. So there's... Is that Omega? I don't know which ones. I don't know these symbols. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, right, okay. Can I get a beverage? No, it's overrun, isn't it? All right, cool. Uh, right. Can I just take the map? No. All right, well, cool. Let's, uh, let's leave. Has it marked them? Pilot, last known position. Cool. Ooh. Locates resources. Scanner room. I'll take that. Beautiful. And this is the no longer a launch facility. What happened here? Okay. I didn't see that. Satellite surveillance. Two active human life forms detected. Unauthorized habitat construction and vehicular activity is detected. Recommended. Observe and prepare for possible intervention. Two life forms. So that's me and the woman. Okay. Cool. Oh, you actually climb up stuff now. <laughs> Test override module. Oh, uh, my temperature's dropping. Yo! Get me out of here. I didn't think... No! No! Is my L just going to start dropping? It's my first time dealing with this. Forgive me. Ah! ah. Oh. Hello? I mean, I'm, I'm in. Cushy setup. Oh. This belonged to one of those higher uppers. Damn. I didn't even see this Maybe until I... Uh... Clues about Sam here. Did they ditch the whole Sam sister? Really skin. I know she had it, in her. it looks like they did. There's no longer the sister-sister the -sister relationship anymore. That's gone. Right? Well, that's unfortunate. I like the, the... The two original voice actors seem to have a really good, like, relationship. Nice. Shame. Yes. New blueprint synthesized. I need that crystalline sulfur, so I could probably get more underground, right? Useful. There's quite a lot of this stuff just laying around. All right. I'm kind of tempted to just check out under the island here. It's literally diving right off of this platform. So how do I get rid of these little markers on the screen? How do I get rid of those? There we go. Gone. <laughs> right. Let's go down here and check this out. There's a bit of danger here, if I remember correctly. No... Take another creature egg. Yeah, look at this. Chance of lead. Holy this. Ah! Ha, ha. 66 oxygen. Oh my god. Alright, map time. Oh, that's so deep! Is there anything even down here? Alright, I gotta start getting out, otherwise I'm gonna die. Oh! Yo, chill! 30 seconds I'm working on it! Okay. Okay, now. You do not trust Altera. No, neither do you. But your sister was Altera. My sister was my sister. She worked for Altera. No! Do not perceive a difference. We are what we work for. Well, Sam wasn't. I, I lost my crystalline sulfur. I clip Sam's wings like I knew they'd do to mine. I tried to warn her, and she was stubborn, just like me. Ever since I was a kid, I always wanted to be so different from her. 
scrappier, faster, way less play by the rules. Was Sam working in the best interest of all time? Yes, but they definitely didn't think so. We believe that individuals may operate in the best interest of the collective or against the best interest of the collective. There is no in-between to us. So you always saw eye to eye on absolutely everything with your network? No. I sense there's more to this story. And more to your sister's story as well. Oh, there is sister's story. That's fine. Okay. Change the subject. We'll come back to it later. So that's going to be everything for episode one of Below Zero's full release. If you're enjoying this so far, don't forget to leave a like. You can definitely see a lot has changed. There's no satellite in the sky anymore. Um, you're not. You're now looking for your sister as opposed to like working kind of with your sister. It's a little bit different. Let me know your thoughts and opinions. Do this in the comments. And if you're looking forward to future content on Below Zero, don't forget to get subscribed. And if you could like this video, that would really, really help me out with the YouTube algorithm. That's going to be everything. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you in episode two.